We want to give you a look at Seattle's Golden Gardens Park earlier today. A gorgeous day. I mean, if you like really, really hot days. Uh, Craig, today was hot, but ah. tomorrow is going to be even hotter. When I was putting the numbers on the high for the map for tomorrow, Steve, I was even in shock. I'm like, is this, this can't be, but uh, yeah. And it, it was, some of the numbers are going to be well above 105. And tomorrow is not the hottest day. Monday is going to be the hottest day where we will see numbers at or around 110. All right, let's get started this evening. Right now, looking out from the studio camera on top of the studios at King 5, rather, looking towards Seattle. Even looking at that picture right now, normally we'd be like, oh, great sunset, but I see all that red, and I'm like, ooh, that looks hot. Current temperatures, 87 in Bremerton, Tacoma at 84. We are still sitting at 89 in Olympia. Head up to Friday Harbor, not bad, 71. Port Angeles doing much better now at 71 after reaching the mid-90s. Two days in a row, just unbelievable. Excessive heat warning covers the state, the entire state, goes all the way to the coast right through Monday evening. The eastern side of the state, we got that in place until Thursday evening. All right, so let's show you the forecasted highs for some of the major cities around the lower 48. We are going for 104 for Seattle tomorrow, four degrees cooler, if you will. Then Las Vegas at 108, warmer than Dallas, warmer than uh, Memphis, Atlanta, Washington, D.C., warmer than New York. I should just be using the word hotter because it's not warmer, it's hotter. High pressure still with us. We've got this gradient that's bringing a lot of the warmer air our direction. We are going to see record-breaking heat, all-time record-breaking heat tomorrow in some spots like Olympia, Seattle, Bellingham. Uh, and then as we go into Monday, we may see those records fall again. This is just incredible. Now, as we pause a moment with Craig, this is Cash enjoying a nice day out at the beach. Remember those puppies? We keep talking about the puppies, the kids, the elderly. Notice 9 a.m. It's 86 degrees, so you want to get them out early, maybe not for a very long walk at all. Overnight lows are going to be in the 70s. That's where we start the day. Typically, that's what we're forecasting for highs. Those are the lows. So even our lows may be setting uh, records for being so high. Highs tomorrow, look at these numbers, 100 to 104, 105, 106, 107, 109 in Shelton, 110 in Puyallup, 110 in Auburn, over to the coast we go. Look at this, 83 degrees, ocean shores, 104 forks, and as we go over to the eastern side of the state, 111 in Yakima. Wenatchee, 110. All right, seven day forecast, 104 tomorrow, 110 on Monday. This is just incredible. We've never had back to back triple digits like this. We've never had this much all time record breaking heat. And even on Tuesday, when we cool, we're still going to be in the lower 90s, Steve. And when we cool, we'll be in the 90s. Yeah. That's how hot it's going to be, guys. That's nuts. So this weekend, it's especially important to track the dangerous heat conditions. You can find the forecast on your smartphone. Just download our King 5 app in Google Play or the Apple App Store.